And then we had like the second turbulence. It was like. You know what? This time I was still not nauseous because, you know, the nausea pill lasts at least like five hours. So it was crazy. Like I really just didn't feel any nausea, but I was scared the entire time. I was like, oh my God, this is the worst turbulence I've ever experienced on an airplane. It's please, please. It was like that. And then it finally ended. And this time I really had to pee because like, you know, the turbulence, we were moving. I was in fear. And then once you're in fear and then you relax when it's over, like you just feel the need to pee extra hard. So I like run to the bathroom. But unfortunately, this lady that was like super close to the bathroom gone in first. And I think she was fucking like throwing up or something. I don't know. She probably was throwing up because she was in there for so long. I was like, oh my god, this lady is me, and I'm finally on the other side of this fucking... Finally! Like, it's usually me that's in the bathroom, like, taking a long time, but this time, I get to witness someone else be sick. I get to, you know, be happy about this because I'm literally always throwing up on the airplane. It's one of the most exhausting experiences ever. When she came out of the bathroom, I was like, do you need a nausea pill? <laughs> but this lady spoke French. And she didn't know what I was saying, and I think she was too sick to, like, really calm down to understand. She was like, no, 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 no. And I was like, okay, okay, it's fine. And I was just about to go into the bathroom. Literally! I opened the door and I stepped in. <laughs> the third turbulence hit us. It was crazy. I was looking up at the sky and being like, bro, I really need to pee. I don't care. I went in there with the turbulence. <laughs> I had to pee, guys. I really had to pee. I was like, yo, there's no way. There's no way you're doing a third turbulence. And I still haven't gone to the bathroom. At this point, like, an hour and a half had passed by since our first turbulence. Okay, like, it's been an hour and a half. Let me pee. So, like, I was literally, like, in the washroom while the fucking plane was like this. So then I was like, oh shit, maybe I shouldn't have gone to the bathroom. Maybe I should like go back right now. But then I thought like, well, I think the turbulence is gonna like settle down soon. Because the, the second one was like... The second one didn't really last that long. It was like a, like a good two minutes and then it went back to normal like, you know, like this. And I was like, okay, yeah, I'll just wait it out. You know, I'll just stand. You know what? Standing is better than sitting when it comes to nausea, at least for me. So I was just like standing in the washroom, wow, <laughs> which is very dangerous, TBH. <laughs> like while the fucking plane was like this, and then I hear the seatbelt sign, which was bing bong, and then the and, you know the fucking captain making the announcement like, please go back to your seats, sit down, and put your seatbelt on. And I was like, oh man, I have to go back, but I couldn't go back because it was like like shaking so hard I could barely open the door. So I was just like, I made the decision. I was like, okay. I am gonna stay in this washroom. So I didn't sit down on the toilet because I swear to God, if I fucking did, guys, if I, like, tried to pee while the fucking turbulence was like this, the pee would have, like, ended up on my head. Like, I'm serious. So I just, like... I just, like, stood there. <laughs> and I didn't want to fucking wait until the third turbulence was over because some other woman was gonna go in. I really needed to pee. I did the standing man emoji in the toilet. <laughs> While the fucking airplane was like this, and at some point, it really, like, actually, like, it's kind of low-key dangerous. Like, I almost hit my head on something, but I was like, whatever, I was gonna die anyways. Like, if this is, like, if this is the third time this is happening, I was like, yo, it doesn't matter at this point, because I think we are gonna die. Like, at least let me pee. And this one lasted so long! I was like, there's no way. Like, it passed the two-minute mark, and I was just like, oh, shit, I should have gone back. I think, like, nobody noticed that I was not in my seat. Probably because, like, the airplane staff couldn't see, like, all everyone. Because they were also seated. Nobody really checked the bathroom or anything, so I don't think they knew that I was in there. But I was in there. This is the scariest part. It was actually crazy. You know how when you shut the bathroom door, the lights go on? And then when the bathroom is open... The bathroom door, I mean. When it's open, the lights go off because nobody's using it. During turbulence, the lights were flickering. And I was like, oh shit, I should have went back and sat down and died with everyone else. Now I'm gonna die with the toilet. <laughs> and 
it was literally just like in turbulence mode for like this was the the third one was the longest one like i seriously i'm not even joking like i i looked at my clock and i was like there's no way this last this one lasted 10 minutes like really guys i'm not even joking like 10 minutes straight it was like 10 minutes of this and I was like, there's no way that the one time that I'm in the bathroom... This is the first time I've been in a bathroom with this much turbulence. And the the only time that the turbulence has lasted so long. I was like, what the fuck? I need to pee. And I was so pissed that I was just about to piss. This is the first time I've been pissed at the universe. I was like, bro, there's no way you're doing this to me. Really? Like, all I need to do was go pee. And then finally, 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 after 10 minutes... The fucking turbulence finally stopped. It was like... It became more consistent like this again. You know, it was like... And then I was like... Can I pee now? Can I, can I pee now? Really? Can I pee? As soon as it stopped, I, I didn't even... Wait, I was like, okay, it stopped. And I heard the seatbelt sound like... Bing bong, so that means you can like fucking... You know, take your seatbelt off. As soon as I heard the bing bong, I like fucking wipe the toilet. You know, put toilet paper on the toilet because even before I die, I still need to, you know, remember my hygiene. I'm not having my ass cheeks touch, you know, the fucking toilet bear. You know, even if I do die. So I did that. I fucking peed as if I was a fucking Niagara Falls. I was like, shh. I pushed everything out of me. I was like, every drop of water that's in my body will be going down this toilet paper. Because I was like, there's gonna be a fourth turbulence. There is gonna be one. There will be one. And I know it's gonna start right when I pee. So I peed so fast. <laughs> I was like, speed. You know, like, you know, speed the hero. I don't know what his name is. Speedo from Marvel. You know, that guy who goes really fast. Or Okay, I was like, Sonic... The hedgehog, but like faster, you know, and only peeing. I was like so scared that I was gonna start peeing and the fourth turbulence was gonna start again. I was like, there's no way. So I sat down, I was like, peed so fast. I peed so fast that I like almost sprained my ankle or something. Cause I don't know. I was just like squeezing every, like my bo whole body was tense. I was like, Every neuron in my brain was focused on me peeing. Like, really? I was so... <laughs> I was really trying to pee and getting every last drop. I was like, there's no way. I was about to cry because I was like, if I sit on this toilet and the fourth turbulence comes, I will throw a man out of this airplane. <laughs> really? So, <laughs> this was the most intense pee I've ever done in my life. And I quickly wiped, washed my hands, got out of the bathroom, sat down. And then I was like, I'm ready for the fourth turbulence. And I was like... And then it didn't come. It didn't come for like two hours. I was like, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready, God. And it just didn't happen. I swear, I was like, bruh. <laughs> And I remember falling asleep because I was so sleepy and tired from, like, the anxiety that I was having inside of the bathroom. You know, I had to pee and I was, like, experiencing turbulence without sitting down and without a seatbelt. All in one go. 